I'm going to show you the best defense in Madden 24 post-patch, guys. EA just patched the game. They basically broke defense. And uh, I'm going to share with you why Dollar is the best defense. There's a lot of different reasons as to why, um, but I'm going to show you the best uh, five-man blitz in the game. This is by far the best five-man blitz. I don't think it's even close. All you're going to do is you're going to come out in DB Fire 2. We're in the 46 playbook. You want to get my full ebook on this. We're updating it, and uh, you're going to need it because defense is going to be really hard going forward. Uh, that's all on the Patreon. Patreon members get access to all of my ebooks, all my updates, everything for just 10 bucks. Link's going to be in the description. Okay, so the best defense in the game is Dollar DB Fire 2, and all we are going to do is we are going to pinch our defensive line, and we are going to stand. Uh, we're going to use the linebacker on the running back and stand on the opposite side a gap, and at the snap of the ball, we're just going to basically try to almost like predetermine they're going to run the ball, and then we're going to run in and hit uh, left trigger. So we're going to predetermine, boom, and you see we got almost almost got a gap there, and we got edge pressure. This is the best send five in the game. Okay, it is the best send five in the game. Okay, you'll see just super consistent. You're going to get five man. You're going to get pressure. They're going to have to block somebody. Now, this is part of the problem with uh, the game right now. If they block a tight end, they will, for the most part, pick this up. Sometimes you can get some sheds or you can get some disengages. But for the most part, they are going to be able to pick up this blitz. So what do we need to do if they block their tight end? We need to blitz. Um, another linebacker. So we're going to blitz our our, um, our linebacker here on the left side. And now what you'll see is we're either going to get a gap pressure or we're going to get edge pressure. So this is pretty much what you want to be doing um, if they if they are going to do that. Now, uh, when you blitz this linebacker on the left, I recommend pinching your linebackers. I think it's just better. Um, as you see right there, you get a little bit better pressure. Uh, so yeah, you're going to, and this will also work against a block running back. So let's say they block a running back. Um, again, all you're doing is just blitzing this linebacker and then you should see block running back. It's a little bit easier to get the pressure in. Now, if they block a running back and they block a tight end, so they max protect now, technically in this example, they're on the same side. So that's not ideal pass pro. Uh, but what you'll see here is they don't pick it up if they're on the same side. Now, let me jump out and I'll show you a bunch, uh, a gun bunch formation, and you'll see a little bit of a, a little bit of a difference. And this is why it's important to have your um, running back and your tight end on opposite sides when you're running an offense normally, uh, because it makes it easier to pick up blitzes. So you'll see here we're going to blitz this guy. Um, actually, yeah, we can blitz. But basically what you'll see is if they block seven, oftentimes they're going to be able to pick you up. So that is the one downside to the defense. But really, this is the best way to get pressure in the game. Um, it, it, it's truly, I don't know of a better way right now to get pressure in this game. And if you can, if you can truly learn how to stop the run out of dollar, this is going to probably be the best defense in the game. So if you want to check out the rest of the dollar defensive ebook, uh, just join the Patreon at the link down in the description. There's a lot of different ways to run dollar, but this is probably the most balanced way. And you get a really, 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 really good edge blitz when they send five out or when they block one person. They're going to have to max pro. And um, this just makes the defense better uh, for you. So they're going to have to block somebody. And typically they're going to have to block two people. And when they have to block two people, then we can go into some different coverage concepts. There's a lot of cool uh, coverage concepts that are available to you out of the dollar defense. And um, I think it has probably the, it's the most balanced. Everybody's going to be running uh, a, an offense that audibles around a lot. You can actually get this four man to come in typically too. So like if I send it like this, I can get four. I can only send, I don't I only need to send four if they're sending five out. Uh, so if like, let's say for example, maybe my base setup is I just man this guy up on the, on the tight end and then if they're not running a lot they don't have a threat of the run this becomes the best blitz in the game guys thanks for watching the video if you want to get my entire dollar defensive ebook join the patreon today 10 bucks get you access to everything including all of the updates we're updating everything with the new patch we're going to have you guys up to speed and better uh, for all the change